week, we shine the spotlight on Riddick star Vin Diesel. This award-winning actor, producer, writer, and director has gained fans from around the world for setting the record straight and looking amazing while doing it. He made his debut in a small part in The Awakenings, then from Private Ryan to The Iron Giant and A Man Apart, this macho man was making his way into the hearts of millions everywhere. The Fast and the Furious made Vin Diesel a household name, and the Chronicles of Riddick threatened to do just the same. In between, Vin Diesel would pick up the kids a la Kindergarten Cop for the pacifier and charm a whole new generation, then play a mafioso in Find Me Guilty. While Vin Diesel begins work on Fast and the Furious 7, we catch up with him for his latest release, Riddick. Vin Diesel may have thought at one point that Riddick was done and over with, but he would have been 100% wrong. It's a character that's always been close to me. It's a character that was my first big character in Hollywood. Um, I think the character is so interesting and so dynamic. And the idea of playing a quintessential anti-hero is uh, something that I could relate to. Um, but most importantly, uh, it was listening to an audience that said, we want the next chapter. The short answer is I made it because it was, the, the, the request for it was very loud and clear. As with all of his films, Vin Diesel told us that he wanted his fans to do one specific thing while enjoying Riddick in theaters. What do I hope the audience will expect? I don't know if I hope the audience. I hope that the audience can escape like any of the movies that I do. I hope that the audience allows himself to escape for two hours and venture into this world. Time's up.